Hi everyone, so we just we've just left um, the University of Hull and we're just on our way back home but we're just talking about what like the things that we're excited about for the trip. How are you feeling about it Paddy? Buzzing. Couldn't Buzzing. be better. Berlin has such an interesting history and I'm just really looking forward to going there in person, spending a week there checking out the sites and looking at the culture and the people of the city. So this is our room. Is this a really good shot? A cat? <laughs> and we're on the 10th floor and we can see the TV tower. We've just all gone for dinner and it's just a nice way to unwind after a long day. Paddy and everyone went out last night so I'm excited to hear what they've got to say about a night out in Berlin. But we got 10 hours sleep so we're feeling really fresh. We'll keep you updated on the trip. Hi, we're here at the rice pack. Right now there's a protest about climate change going on and they've thrown a bunch of papers down on the ground. What are your opinions, Jasmine, on this? Interesting. It's not every day a protest happens in the rice tag building about climate change. Right now, the building in the back is the Cathedral of Berlin. It's also the biggest cathedral here. And to the right of it, you can we'll see... Go outside, so can stay away. You just ruined my video, Paddy! What do you think of this building, Leah? It's amazing. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> We went out last night, we went for a few cocktails, um, well it wasn't cocktails, it was beer. We just drank beer here um, and it, there were some really cool bars. We ended up going to a ballroom, disco, and we were the youngest people there but it was a good laugh and we learnt some new dance moves. Have you ever had roast potatoes for breakfast? Kat, what have you got this morning? Bacon sandwich, fried eggs, and fried potatoes too, really interesting. We're just at the Berlin Wall at the moment. So what do you think about the Berlin Wall uh, being painted? I think it's really cool. I think it's an important part of Berlin's history. And I think painting it mm. is something that the current generation can relate to. Making a positive out of a negative. It's nice to get out into the field. It's one thing like looking at a book and reading about these places, but to actually go out and experience it, it's a really cool thing. We're at the Brandenburg Gate at the moment, um, in per Pariser Platz. We're conducting our field work at the moment. What are we finding difficult? Like, what are the challenges? The language barrier is one at the moment. Yeah. People generally just not want to be irritated. People don't want to be interviewed. Obviously, it's got the heritage and it's yeah. got the history behind it. But people come here, they they can be whoever they want to be, and it's really chill. And you can see that through the like the expression, people wear whatever they want here, and it's just it's really relaxed. So we're here in Potsdamer Platz. We're here to do some well-deserved shopping after a long week of work. Mm -hmm. So it's our last day. We're making the most of it. So guys, we're in the shopping mall. There's a slide from the third floor all the way down. It's the day we're going back home now. It's gone really quick. Really sad to leave. We ha we've had a really fantastic week, but also glad to go home to get into our own beds. What's been your favourite part of the trip? I'd say just walking around with people and like, having a good time. Like, we've been able to like, learn, but have a good like, laugh and chat as well while we're doing it. So it's been really fun. So yeah, I got to experience the city as a group and not just on your own.